there. Hey, 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 it's Stacy with Kiss and Makeup with, by Stacy with an eye. And I have a question. Do you struggle with doing your skincare and washing your face consistently? Because I definitely do. I definitely need some accountability. So my first accountability is coming on live to do this with you guys, to be accountable. Um, so let me take my glasses off so I can wash my face. So I'm just going to wipe my face, or sorry, I have to lean down to get into the sink. I'm just going to wipe my, or wet my face. And then I need to grab my, one of the things I do to be more consistent is I keep my cleanser, my three in one cleanser in the shower. So when I shower every morning, I can wash it, but I really struggle with doing it at night because I often will like be washing TV or whatever and fall asleep on the couch and be super tired um, and not do it. And like, and then just like, you know, wake up from the couch and then go slowly into, and then go right into my bed. So you just, I literally like this three in one cleanser for three reasons. One, I'm lazy, super duper lazy. So the more steps you can do in one, the better. And this is a cleanser, cleanser. Oh my goodness. Clearly I'm tired. A cleanser, toner and an exfoliator, I think. I forget what the third one is. All in one. So if I can do less steps, I'm going to do less steps. Then I'm just going to take my washcloth with, this is really a magic eraser. Cause you know, I don't know where my washcloth is and wash off my face. So there's that. And then I'm going to take my towel that of course I can't find my hand towel because I was doing laundry. So there's that. Um, put the top, put the, um, put in the comments below if you struggle what your biggest skincare or washing your face struggle is, or if you struggle at all, because if you don't, I'm super jealous. All right. So then I'm going to start with my neotite. This is for the eyes. So I'm going to put a little blob. It helps with fine lines and wrinkles and under eye circles and all that. So that, whoops, and I'm going to drop stuff on. Okay. So this is all you need for both eyes. I started when I first, when this first product first came out and I first started using it, I only did it on one eye until I had a friend say to me, um, Stacy, like what's up with your eyes? Something looks a little weird. So anyway, so I do that every night. Well, I should be doing that every night and every morning, but again, I do not do my skincare consistently. So just imagine how much better my face would look if I didn't pick my zits and I did my skincare consistently. Next product is this amazing blue goo that's almost out, but I don't want to waste a drop. This is um, hyaluronic acid and the uh, molecules are so small that it gets really deep into your, um, into your skin and super hydrates it, which is awesome because I have pretty dry skin. Um, so you're just gonna put that all over. And then because the molecules are so small so they can go so deep into your skin, you need to seal it in with an evening or daytime moisturizer if you're using it in the morning so that it doesn't escape. So this is our day, our nighttime moisturizer. Why do we have two different moisturizers, you might ask? Let me tell you. So in the my daytime moisturizer has an SPF equivalent of uh, blah, 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 a chemical shield with an SPF equivalent of 15. This does not because I'm not going in the sun, I'm going to bed. And this is also thicker and more luxurious so that it like really works well in the night. Also in the daytime, you often want to put like makeup on over your moisturizer and stuff. The goal is to be a glazed donut at bedtime. Can you guys put drop a donut? Is there a donut emoji in the comments? If there is, do it. Um, if you want help being held accountable, um, we're actually doing my, like a whole group of us is doing, that's one of the things I love about the Senate Sisterhood and like all the girls in the group and stuff is that they're doing, um, a skincare accountability group where there would be prizes and stuff and help you be accountable. Like once you can start a habit, then maybe it'll continue to be a habit. So if you want in, drop me or skincare or DM me or something, it's no cost or anything, but it'll teach you. Actually, I'm excited because I'm going to learn a lot more about skincare because I don't know as much as I should, but I know I want to look younger as long as possible. Or I don't know. I don't even know if I want that. Anyway, I want my I want to take good care of my skin as much as I can. And this is my last product I do. It is the watermelon overnight lip mask, and it smells like a jolly a watermelon jolly rancher, and I love it. So I'm going to just take some, and my lips are always chapped because I don't drink enough water, and I lift them. So I'm just gonna slather that on there. 
So if you're interested in the skincare accountability challenge, there'll be really cool prizes and hopefully it'll help you keep accountable. It's May, I think, 15th-ish through 19th-ish. If that's a Monday through Friday or somewhere around that, drop uh, me in the comments below and let me know because I want to make sure that I have time to give you... Um, to get you the skincare samples, that's the thing. You get some samples and then wash your face together and maybe win some prizes and learn about good skincare. Anyway, I hope you all have a good night. I am now going to bed. Bye. Oh, and don't forget, Kiss and Makeup by Stacy. I'm Stacy from Kiss and Makeup by Stacy with an I. Kiss and Makeup by Stacy with an I. And I help women who no longer have 20 or something skin with quick and easy makeup, skin, skincare tips and tricks. Have a good night. Bye.